I didn't even do nothing to him. Get out of here. I got a swirly, I guarantee you he's not. Yeah. I think he'd stop telling other people about it. Oh. Yes, dear. Stop laughing. That's a question. No. I see it out there. I don't know. TikTok. I'm not on TikTok. I, don't know. I, I see it on Instagram and I see it on Twitter. But I don't want TikTok. I don't
school, brother. We would have got food or something. We'd have to send them over there. No, no, go down there. No, go over there.
Let's try this. Purple. 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 Graduates, you may be seated. <laughs> Congratulations, graduates. Graduates, parents, family, faculty, friends, staff, and guests. Welcome to the Spring 2023 College of Fine Arts and Communication graduation ceremony. My name is Linda Keene, and I'm the Dean of the College of Fine Arts and Communication. I am so happy to be here today, and I'm glad you could all join us as we honor the accomplishments of today's graduating class. Celebrating and honoring our graduates is such an important milestone. Graduates, even through all the turmoil of the past several years, you have exceeded the expectations we have set for you. Most of you arrived on campus in the fall of 2019, only to be told not to come back after spring break. You had a few short-lived weeks on campus in fall 2020, and back home again you went. Your classes have pivoted and pivoted again. And through it all, you have pers persevered. In fact, you did more than persevere, you thrived. You have danced and drawn, painted and performed, created and crafted, written and reported, often from your living rooms, dorm rooms, and kitchen tables. We are so glad that for the last few semesters, we have been able to gather again on campus for classes, performances, exhibitions, and fellowship. I commend you on all that you have done to get to this point today. From here, you move on to pursue a variety of goals and aspirations. As you move forward, I hope that you remain confident in yourselves and the skills and abilities you have already mastered. Today, we recognize graduates from four different but synergistic schools, the School of Art and Design, the School of Communication, the School of Music, and the School of Theater and Dance. <laughs> While each school has its unique personality and discipline, the sum of our programs is indeed powerful. Through your collective efforts, we continue to serve as beacons of arts, culture, and community in our region. The work you are doing has the capacity to inform and transform, to move audiences emotionally, and to persuade with facts and reason. With this power comes the potential to use your talents to make this world what you want it to be. I encourage you to consider what you see for yourselves, your community, and the future, and use your gifts to bring about the reality you desire. I am so proud of you all. Congratulations. I now have the honor to introduce our speaker for today's ceremony. An eclectic jeweler and metalsmith, Bob Evendorf was born in Topeka, Kansas, and received his BFA and MFA from the University of Kansas. He went on to study at the State School of Applied Arts and Crafts in Norway, thanks to a Fulbright Award. Since then, Bob has worked as a jewelry designer all over the world. He has shared his craft through teaching at a number of institutions, finally serving as the Belt Distinguished Professor at ECU in the School of Art and Design from 1998 to 2013. He has received many, many awards, including the Lewis Comfort Tiffany Grant, the North Carolina Governor's Award in the Arts, and more than I can list. His work is housed in the Metropolitan Museum of Art in New York, the Victorian and Al Victoria and Albert Museum of Art in London, and other prestigious locations around the world. Bob, I look forward to hearing your remarks. Thank you. I stand before you with great gratitude to be a part of a very special day for you and for your parents 
and your loved ones. You've walked the plank. You've had the down days. You've had the up days. And today, you come together with loved ones, friends, and your family. And it might be the last time some of you are together. But one of the greatest gifts that is also given to you today is the many friendships that you have come to know during your time here. And those friendships will continue to be rich if you nourish them, celebrate them, and stay in touch. They're family, just like your family. I come from a family that I was the first generation to go to a university and receive a degree and in art. My parents didn't really understand what was going to happen and how that would play out, but they believed in me and they stayed with me in the good times and definitely in the down times. So you have a lot of tool in your toolkit that you have gleaned from being here. And you have a lot of gratitude from those teachers. You didn't get along with all of them, but many of them you did. And before you leave, be sure to find them and give them a thank you because you also will be asking for letters of recommendation, I'm sure. <laughs> I'm still writing them, and with pleasure. So it's payback time. Also, many of you will find yourself in positions within perhaps corporations or companies. And also, too, there'll be times for you to possibly step up to the plate and endow a scholarship to that department or to help the institution continue to be moving forward. If I can leave you with any one gift or one thought, as I thought about standing before you, what would it be? No matter what field you're in, but follow that passion and curiosity that curiosity will lead you down roads and paths that you maybe would not follow or not enter into. So embrace that curiosity and open those doors. The world isn't for you. You can move to the next, not level, but to the next experience. And the gratitude to your mother, fathers, and family and loved ones who would get the phone calls and say, well, it's been a good week or it's been a difficult week, or, Dad, can you put some more money in the bank account? I mean, I know my daughter has called and asked that question, and I was, we were there for her. So today is not only a special day for you all, as well as these people, but also for the many instructors and professors who has put the, put the bar high and asked you to keep your eye on the target and deliver. So it's, it was totally those, the time, a team effort, as well as your roommate and the many new friendships that you will inherit as you travel on. Gratitude and being humble and saying thank you. My mother always used to say, remember to write that thank you note. And uh, I'm not computer literate in this time, I'm 83 years old, but I do a lot of postcards and a lot of stamps. So my wife says, well, your, your postal uh, account is a backup. Again, you can run it that way. But stay in touch. Definitely stay in touch with your university and the professors and your loved ones here. I feel very honored and very humbled to stand here before you and be a part of this very festive day. It was amazing that just the sense of joy as you were coming in from here, from there, your feistiness, your playfulness. And life, 
of gratitude. So as you travel forward from here, remember East Carolina, remember Greenville, and definitely remember the, your friendships and the professors that touched your light and turned it on. So today, I stand here and celebrate your accomplishments and your joys looking forward to the next level and the next challenge. Be warriors, be pirates, and stay in touch with your loved ones, the family, and with the institution. Because we all stood there on the good days, and also the door was always open for those difficult days. During my time here, it was such a gift with the colleagues and definitely with people such as sitting before me. So as you move forward and enjoy the rest of the day and celebration, I come here with great gratitude to be a part of your dance and your special day. So I thank you. Bob, thank you so much for those heartfelt words. Now I would like to welcome each school director to the podium so they can address today's graduates. We will hear from the directors of art and design, communication, nope. Oh, I'm not, I'm not right. Hold on, hold on. I got nothing in here. Okay. I'm gonna introduce Jamie Host, the director of the School of Theater and Dance, and she's gonna set us straight. <laughs> Good afternoon. Before the directors speak, I have the great privilege of introducing two of our outstanding undergraduates in the School of Theater and Dance, Madison Krismanich and Jessica Bolton, who are going to delight our ears by performing For Good from the musical Wicked. Like 
like a seed dropped by a sky bird in a distant wood. Who can say if I've been changed for the better? But because I knew you, because I knew you, I have been changed. I've done you blame me for well then I guess you know there's blame to share and none of it seems to matter anymore because I knew you because I knew you I have been Is the mic off? Oh, there we go. <laughs> um, so I, my name is Kate Bukowski, and I am the director of the School of Art and Design. And it is my honor and pleasure to congratulate the graduating class of spring 2023 from the College of Fine Arts Communication, and especially from the School of Art and Design. Graduates, you've spent the last four or more years pulling all-nighters, getting ready for critiques, and trying to find your way around Jenkins. You become a vital part of our creative community. You grew your ideation and creative problem solving skills, became skilled at thinking through making, explored media and techniques across disciplines, and engaged in intensive research. You worked hard and spent long hours, days, months, and years in Jenkins, making, thinking, writing, creating, and forging your path to today. As you look back on your experience at ECU, remember those who helped you arrive at this moment, outstanding faculty who helped you explore your passions, staff who supported and who helped you learn in the wood shop and, and hang your exhibition, and importantly, your family and friends who listened to your challenges, supported you through encouragement and warm hugs, and cheered you every step of the way. Today, we celebrate you and your achievements, from theses and senior exhibitions, film and reel screenings, portfolio reviews, student teaching, to culminating papers. These milestones are testimony to your hard work. I know each of you will use your skills and knowledge to make the world a better place, from your family, to your career, to your community, and beyond. We will fill the ripples of your work for years to come. Congratulations, art and design graduates and college graduates, and go Pirates. Good afternoon, everyone. What a joyous day it is. My name is Laura Privadera. I'm the director of the School of Communication. <laughs> Thank you so much. Um, as the director of the School of Communication, it is my pleasure to celebrate the achievements of our undergraduate and graduate students here today. And of course, I celebrate everyone in our college. Our discipline of communication is wide and varied, offering tremendous opportunities and responding to so many important needs in our society. The adaptability of our communication discipline is certainly front and center as we continue to navigate societal opportunities as well as challenges. Through effective communication, we achieve goals and rewards, and we know our graduates will achieve and do great things. They are prepared and they have spent years honing their craft. 
Our graduates will go on to be amazing journalists, telling powerful stories, anchors who will share the evening news, public relations specialists who will frame messages, sales representatives who will market and sell products, media professionals who will educate and who will educate on digital literacy, social media experts who will explain the impact of Twitter as well as that next new media platform that maybe we don't even know about. The possibilities and opportunities are endless, and that journey begins today. Congratulations to all of our undergraduate and graduate communication scholars and graduates today. And for our undergraduate students who are interested in continuing their education, talk with Dr. Keith Richards about our amazing master's in communication with a focus in strategic communication. Good afternoon. My name's Chris Olfers, and I have the pleasure of serving as director of the School of Music. To all of the graduates and family members here today, my most sincere congratulations. Graduates, the past couple of days have been pretty incredible days for celebration. Lots and lots of purple, and of course, lots of pictures in these funny robes and hats with our friends and our family at the fountain, at the pirate statue on the quad, at the cupola, and at the giant EECU letters outside the student center. But as you prepare to leave campus, some of you maybe for a while, I want you to take some time to reflect. First, I want you to reflect about your peers and your professors. These are the people that have seen you at your best and probably at your worst. These are the people who've seen your most joyous days and maybe your most melancholy ones. They have seen the person you were when you arrived on campus for the very first time, and now see the person that you have become. These are the people that have shaped and will continue to shape you through whatever your steps might be. All of the students here, all of the graduates here, will have a little Professor X on your shoulder who will guide you through all of this. Every time you pick up your instrument, every time you give a presentation, every time you have a dance, every time you get a role, there'll be Professor X sitting on your shoulder, right? Remember those people and reflect on that. Reflect on the importance of those people in your lives. But I also want you to reflect on your experiences with COVID because you are the COVID class. You are the COVID, at least the undergraduates. The graduate students, you all came here during the pandemic. Sort of incredible. But the undergraduates, as freshmen, you arrived here, you were here for six months, and then you were told to go home. Right, parents? My daughter was a freshman in the fall of 2019. She graduated in HHP. I've been here since 11 o'clock. And I'm acutely aware of how life changed for all of us. But I want you to take just a couple of minutes to think about something. This is your where were you when moment. Every generation seems to have one. Let me say that again. This is your where were you when moment. Your moment, you all we all have a generational moment where we know exactly where we were at exactly a moment in time. For some of you, parents, grandparents, that was JFK's assassination, Martin Luther King's assassination, the space shuttle Challenger exploding, 9 11. Most of the, all of the undergraduates here, almost all of the undergraduates here hadn't been born yet. This is your where were you when moment. 
And you all remember it, right? I distinctly remember it. I was on an airplane on the tarmac in Mobile, Alabama, reading news on my phone, and I came across an article that, and we'd all been sort of thinking about this, but I came across an article that talked about social distancing. It's a common word in our lexicon now, right? I wrote it down in my phone because I couldn't remember. I was like, social distancing? What is that? But now this sort of thing is common. You all are going to have those vivid memories. And there's lots of stories we're going to tell, right? The stories are going to include wearing masks to sing in. How horrible is that? Going to the grocery store to find toilet paper? <laughs> Hand sanitizer? Having to use bell covers when we played our instruments? Yeah. But we also have really cool stories, like the invention of food delivery. But we all figured it out. We successfully learned how to learn online, and we successfully learned how to work through this thing we call, in general now, COVID. But you'll all have stories of perseverance, dedication, and learning. But the funny part about that is, regardless of COVID, you'd still have stories of perseverance, dedication, and learning. And learning more about everything you thought that you couldn't do. And that's what I want you to remember. I want you to remember that you did all that stuff despite COVID. Congratulations. Have a great time with your family and friends. <laughs> Good afternoon, everyone. My name is Jamie Klinger Host, and I'm the director for the School of Theater and Dance. To our, sp <laughs> to our spring 2023 graduates, it is indeed a privilege to share this day with each one of you. While at ECU, you have embraced your education in the liberal arts, fusing historical and theoretical studies with creative work. The immersion in both scholarship and performance that you have experienced here the past years has provided you with an excellent basis for any pursuit, which demands leadership ability, collaborative skill, practical expertise, and creative intelligence. You all have had opportunities and an education that so many folks who came before you never could have dreamed of. During your time here, you have grappled in the streets of Verona, helped Edward Tulane through life adventures, assisted Lysistrata on her mission to end the Peloponnesian War by withholding marital relations, and celebrated the amazing art born of the Harlem Renaissance in the musical swing. You've danced the great works of our student choreographers, outstanding faculty, and guest artists such as hip-hop artist Jojo Grooves and Balanchine specialist Roland Culler. You've performed classic works such as Jules from Sleeping Beauty and Petipa's ballet, La Bayadere. You built all the beautiful sets, designed the lights, called all of the cues to make these shows accessible to our community. You have accomplished all of this through a global pandemic, a time of social unrest, and a national financial crisis. The word that comes to mind that describes these graduates before us is resilient. You completed a degree despite great challenges. You are change makers. You will excel because you have proven that no obstacle will hold you back from success. You have the power to change history, share your gifts, and make this world a much better place because you're in it. During our dance study abroad trip last summer to Nairobi, Kenya, over the threshold of one of the schools at which we taught was inscribed the phrase, enter to learn, depart to serve. Today is the day you walk across the threshold from being a student at ECU to being a professional. And as you start to not just reach for your goals, 
but begin to fulfill your destiny, I employ you to remember that motto and continue to serve your communities as you ascend to great heights in your careers. To all of the graduates in the College of Fine Arts and Communication, we sincerely congratulate you on your outstanding achievements and wish you abundant joy and great success. Congratulations, Pirates. Thank you, everyone. And I would also like to take a moment to thank our student performers, um, our music students led by director Bill Staub in the back. Thank you very much. And our two theater students who gave such a wonderful performance. Thank you very much. One of the things I love about being a part of this college is having um, a ceremony in which our students get to participate and show off their talents. So thank you very much. Let's see what happens next. Okay, <laughs> now we're gonna present the graduates. So I, I have no script, <laughs> sorry. So our students, our master's students will first come to the stage and be hooded and recognized by their um, area and their um, master's thesis um, advisor or their graduate um, program coordinator. Hi everyone, this is the exciting moment where we begin the recognition of our graduates. Our grad, we'll start with our graduate students and then followed by our undergraduate students. Um, just remember that a photograph will be taken of you when you get your diploma, so you might wanna get ready for that special moment. I also just wanna take a, a moment to thank all of our faculty and advisors and staff for their amazing work in putting this ceremony together. Thank you all so much. Okay, this is the exciting moment, so let's begin. Incha Poon, <laughs> Master of Arts in Communication, Concentration, Health Communication. Dr. Satyo Shearman will be assisting with the hooding for the School of Communication. Anthony Dean Doughty, Master of Arts in Communication, Concentration, Strategic Communication. Caitlin Francis, Master of Arts in Communication, Concentration, Strategic Communication. Emily Holloway, Master of Arts in Communication, Concentration, Strategic Communication. <laughs> James Devon Holmes, Jr. Master of Arts in Communication, Concentration, Strategic Communication. <laughs> James, did I say it right?
Sarah Grace Ramsey, Master of Arts in Communication, Concentration Strategic Communication. Please join me in congratulating our Master of Arts in Communication students. It's my honor to recognize our graduate students in the School of Art and Design. So first, graduating with a Master of Fine Arts in Art, Concentration in Metal Design, Nicholas Hessen, whose thesis is titled Immortal Bodies. <laughs> Nicholas is joined by Professor Tim Lazor. Master of Fine Arts and Art with a concentration in metal design, Anthony Nemo. Thesis titled, Assembly Required. Master of Fine Arts and Art, Concentration in Photography, Tim Christensen. Thesis titled, Neotype, Replace What is Lost. He's joined on stage by Professor Angela Wells and Professor Daniel Carrico. Master of Fine Arts and Art with a concentration in photography, Morgan Zicatella. Thesis titled, River Rat. Master of Fine Arts and Art with a concentration in sculpture, Thaddeus Prevet. Thesis titled, The Legend of Aeon, a Sculptural Monomyth. He's joined by Professor Tim Lazor. Master of Arts in Education, Art Education, Naomi Jordan. <laughs> Naomi is joined by Dr. Robbie Quinn. Congratulations to our graduate students in the School of Art and Design. We're really proud of everything you've accomplished.
It is now my distinct privilege to present the graduates receiving the Master of Music degree. Brandon Elliott Armstrong, Master of Music with concentration in music performance. Jordan Virginia May Cartret, Master of Music with Concentration in Music History and Literature. Thesis title, Nature, Heart, Life, The Life and Works of Alma Mahler. Michael Anthony Cheerup III, Master of Music with Concentration in Sacred Music Organ. <laughs> Sandro Da Silva. Master of Music with Concentration in Sacred Music, Organ. Yeah. Ashley Cook Donahoe. Master of Music with Concentration in Music Education. Grant Austin Hughes, Master of Music with Concentration in Theory. Thesis title, An Analysis and Performance Guide of Dave Brubeck's Point on Jazz. Drew Johnson, Master of Music with Concentration in Music Performance. <laughs> Tina Michelle Langevin, Master of Music with Concentrations in Vocal Pedagogy and Voice Performance. <laughs> Nicholas Philip Mackey, Master of Music with Concentration in Music Performance. Thalia Eleni Oosley, Master of Music with Concentration in Music Performance.
Joshua Blaine Pittman, Master of Music with Concentration in Choral Conducting. Alvin Lee Taylor, Master of Music with Concentration in Music Performance. Faith Elizabeth Walker, Master of Music with Concentrations in Vocal Pedagogy and Voice Performance. Jared Alan Yoakum, Master of Music with Concentration in Music Performance. <laughs> Jong Hee Yoon. Master of Music with Concentration in Sacred Music Organ. Congratulations, graduates. It is now my pleasure to invite Professor Daniel Carrico from the School of Art and Design to the podium for the presentation of graduates for the Bachelor of Fine Arts degree. Hello, everyone. It is my great pleasure to recognize our graduates. All right. Courtney Cox, Bachelor of Fine Art in Art Education. <laughs> Erica Moncrief, Bachelor of Fine Arts in Art Education. Rachel Elizabeth Spencer, Bachelor of Fine Arts in Art Education. <laughs> Lauren Burke, Bachelor of Fine Arts in Animation and Interactive Design. <laughs> Kara Corman, Bachelor of Fine Arts in Animation, Interactive Design, and Illustration. <laughs> Jayla Fisher, Bachelor of Fine Arts in Animation and Interactive Design. <laughs> Raul Hernandez Lopez, Bachelor of Fine Arts in Animation and Interactive Design. Alexandria Isaac, Bachelor of Fine Arts in Animation and Interactive Design. Nikki Lyles, Bachelor of Fine Arts in Animation and Interactive Design. <laughs> 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 
Kevin Montes Palacios, Bachelor of Fine Arts in Animation and Interactive Design. Lindsay Grace Mumpower, Bachelor of Fine Arts in Animation and Interactive Design. Zoe Passion, Bachelor of Fine Arts in Animation and Interactive Design. Abdul Karim Tonal Spencer, Bachelor of Fine Arts in Animation and Interactive Design. Jaron Emil Vilkins, Bachelor of Fine Arts in Animation and Interactive Design. Hannah Kathleen Topping, Bachelor of Foreign Arts in Ceramics and Art Education. <laughs> Tradisha T. Simpson, Bachelor of Fine Arts in Metal Design. <laughs> Logan Stevens, Bachelor of Fine Arts in Metal Design. R.J. Bowie, Bachelor of Fine Arts in Film and Video Production. <laughs> Terry Jetter, BFA in Film and Video Production. <laughs> Cora McCullough, BFA in Film and Video Production. Dyson Odette, Bachelor of Fine Arts in Film and Video Production. <laughs> Samaher Habas Sabahadin, Bachelor of Fine Arts in Film and Video Production. <laughs> Jeremy Michael Stepp, Bachelor of Fine Arts in Film and Video Production. Mark Windham, Bachelor of Fine Arts in Film and Video Production. <laughs> Madeline Jira Beckes, Bachelor of Fine Arts in Graphic Design. Randy Baines, Bachelor of Fine Arts in Graphic Design. Jalen Blanks, Bachelor of Fine Arts in Graphic Design. <laughs> Michael Davies, Bachelor of Graphic Design. <laughs> Tra Mi Do, Bachelor of Fine Arts in Graphic Design. Jacob Gant, Bachelor of Fine Arts in Graphic Design. <laughs> Zach Hall, Bachelor of Fine Arts in Graphic Design. Savannah Harris, Bachelor of Fine Arts in Graphic Design. Danielle Jackson, Bachelor of Fine Arts in Graphic Design. <laughs> Jacob Jones, Bachelor of Fine Arts in Graphic Design. And Religious Studies. <laughs> Kinnicky Jordan, Bachelor of Fine Arts in Graphic Design. Chandra Jade Leviner, Bachelor of Fine Arts in Graphic Design. <laughs> Olivia Magistro, 
Bachelor of Fine Arts in Graphic Design. Kennedy Norman, Bachelor of Fine Arts in Graphic Design. Devin Pellucci, Bachelor of Fine Arts in Graphic Design. Zaria Nadine Richardson, Bachelor of Fine Arts in Graphic Design. Mary Jo Cordes Rosas, Bachelor of Arts in Graphic Design and Illustration. Jordan Peter Shelfo, Bachelor of Arts in Graphic Design. Leah Smith, Bachelor of Fine Arts in Graphic Design. Kira Venice, Bachelor of Fine Arts in Graphic Design. Yeah. <laughs> Jalisha Armstrong, Bachelor of Fine Arts in Graphic Design. Kara Everson, Bachelor of Graphic, uh, uh, Bachelor of Fine Arts in Graphic Design, an oh, illustration. <laughs> Rachel Ann Gormley, Bachelor of Fine Arts in Illustration. <laughs> Sam Goritz, Bachelor of Fine Arts in Illustration. Nat Harrison, Bachelor of Fine Arts in Illustration and Animation. <laughs> Selena Meza, Bachelor of Fine Arts in Illustration. <laughs> Sebastian Alexander Velasquez, Bachelor of Fine Arts in Animation and Illustration. Laura Beth Curran, Bachelor of Fine Arts in Painting. <laughs> Brian Mendez, Bachelor of Fine Arts in Printmaking. <laughs> Brittany Arborough, Bachelor of Fine Arts in Printmaking. Logan Adkins, Bachelor of Fine Arts in Photography. <laughs> Courtney Eads, Bachelor of Fine Arts in Photography. <laughs> Elizabeth Goldberg, Bachelor of Fine Arts in Photography. Robert Lucard, Bachelor of Fine Arts in Photography. Imari Smith, Bachelor of Fine Arts in Photography. Renee Christine Herlong, Bachelor of Fine Arts in Textile Design and Metals Design. Alexis Heron, Bachelor of Fine Arts in Textile Design. <laughs> Megan Christine Miller, Bachelor of Fine Arts in Textile Design. <laughs> Kelly Marie Norris, Bachelor of Fine Arts in Textile Design.
I would like to again congratulate all of our graduates from the School of Art and Design and invite Professor Parker to introduce graduates from uh, theater and dance. Thank you, Professor Carrico. It is my honor to be announcing the graduates of the School of Theater and Dance. Reagan Michelle Blackburn, BA Theater Arts, dual degree, Bachelor of Science in Communication, Public Relations. Tom Gregus, Bachelor of Arts, Theater Arts. <laughs> Kelly Madison Holt, BFA, Bachelor of Fine Arts, Dance, Dance Education. <laughs> Elizabeth Bailey, Bachelor of Fine Arts, Dance, Dance Performance and Choreography. Thank you. Thank you. Kyleen Constant, Bachelor of Fine Arts Dance, Dance Performance and Choreography. <laughs> Haley Ray DiGirolamo, Bachelor of Fine Arts Dance, Dance Performance and Choreography. <laughs> Jacqueline Anita Dodds, Bachelor of Fine Arts Dance Performance and Choreography. Caroline Joanne Gilligan, Bachelor of Fine Arts Dance, Dance Performance and Choreography. <laughs> Samantha Halick, Bachelor of Fine Arts Dance, Dance Performance and Choreography. Okay, sorry. Sorry. Samantha Halick. Bachelor of Fine Arts, Dance, Dance Performance and Choreography. Sarah Elizabeth Hicks, Bachelor of Fine Arts, Dance, Dance Performance and Choreography. McKenna Brooke Holly, BF Bachelor of Fine Arts, Dance, Dance Performance and Choreography. Taylor Jones, Bachelor of Fine Arts, Dance, Dance Performance and Choreography. <laughs> Melody Angelina Martinez, Bachelor of Fine Arts, Dance, Dance Performance and Choreography. <laughs> Katrina Scarlett Orifici, Bachelor of Fine Arts, Dance, Dance Performance and Choreography. Dual degree, Bachelor of Science in Communication Journalism. Stella Blue Roth, Bachelor of Fine Arts Dance, Dance Performance and Choreography. Ashlyn Ulrich, Bachelor of Fine Arts Dance, Dance Performance and Choreography. Jake Bell, Bachelor of Fine Arts, Theater Arts, Theater Design and Production. <laughs> Francesca Lucia Guinan Martinez, Bachelor of Fine Arts, Theater Arts, Theater Design and Production. <laughs> Thomas Price, Bachelor of Fine Arts, Theater Arts, Theater Design and Production. Grace Gardner, Bachelor of Fine Arts, Theater Arts, Theater for Youth. Aubrey Jenkins, Bachelor of Kirby Jameson Lee, Bachelor of Fine Arts, Theater Arts, Theater for Youth. Tatiana Nicole Burris, Bachelor of Fine Arts, Theater Arts, Professional Actor Training and Theater Arts Education. <laughs> Maurice, Maurice Clark, Bachelor of Fine Arts, Theater Arts, Professional Actor Training. <laughs> Aaron.
Aaron Mitchell Ford, Bachelor of Fine Arts, Theater Arts, Professional Actor Training and Musical Theater. <laughs> Jamon Reynolds Hughes, Bachelor of Fine Arts, Theater Arts, Professional Actor Training. <laughs> Jenna Keefreiter, Bachelor of Fine Arts, Theater Arts, Professional Actor Training, and Teaching English to Speakers of Other Languages Certificate. Kylie Madison McCormack, Bachelor of Fine Arts, Theater Arts, Professional Actor Training, and Theater Arts Education. Bobby Moreno, Bachelor of Fine Arts, Theater Arts, Professional Actor Training. Bradley Holland Peacock, Bachelor of Fine Arts, Theater Arts, Professional Actor Training. Double major, Bachelor of Science in Communication, Interpersonal Organizational Communication. Madison Bodie, Bachelor of Fine Arts, Theater Arts, Musical Theater. Camden Philip Hare, Bachelor of Fine Arts, Theater Arts, Musical Theater. Allie Hensler, Bachelor of Fine Arts, Theater Arts, Musical Theater. <laughs> Allie Grace Jesse, Bachelor of Fine Arts, Theater Arts, Musical Theater, and Professional Actor Training. Nina Maloshiski, BFA Theater Arts, Musical Theater. Rebecca Marie Marler, Bachelor of Fine Arts, Theater Arts, Musical Theater, Professional Actor Training. <laughs> Haley Middles, Bachelor of Fine Arts, Theater Arts, Musical Theater, Theater Arts Education. <laughs> Lauren Lee Moore, Bachelor of Fine Arts, Theater Arts, Musical Theater, Professional Actor Training. Riley Yates, Bachelor of Fine Arts, Theater Arts, Musical Theater, and Bachelor of Fine Arts, Theater Arts Education. I now invite Miss Judy Barber to announce the Bachelor of Music graduates. It is my honor to recognize the recipients of the Bachelor of Music degree. Cameron Cox, Bachelor of Music in Music, Concentration in Music Therapy. <laughs> Kathleen Harris, Bachelor of Music, Music, Concentration, Music Therapy. Shalise Christine Melendez, Bachelor of Music, Music Concentration and Music Therapy. Jaden Brown, Bachelor of Music, Music, Music Performance. Eric Friedlander, Bachelor of Music, Music, Concentration, Music, Concentration. Alana Jude Perrin, Bachelor of Music, Music, Concentration, Music, Performance. Yeah. Jonah Smith, Bachelor of Music, 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 Performance. Jazz. <laughs> Zion Stevens, Bachelor of Music, Music, Concentration, Music, Performance. Camden Stoll, Bachelor of Music, Music, Concentration, Music Performance. Tucker Vance Wright, Bachelor of Music, Music Performance.
Gabriel Alvarado, Bachelor of Music, Music Education. Anna Marie Armstrong, Bachelor of Music, Music Education. <laughs> Crystal Barber, Bachelor of Music, Music Education. Matthew Christopher Brannon, Bachelor of Music, Music Education. Maraid Olivia Colby, Bachelor of Music, Music Education. Daniel Manuel Eckes, Bachelor of Music, Music Education, Bachelor of Music, Music Performance. Samuel Giles, Bachelor of Music, Music Education. Jacob Hartman, Bachelor of Music, Music Education. <laughs> Riley Moore, Bachelor of Music, Music Education. Ayana Sierra Marino, Bachelor of Music, Music Education. Megan Minster, Bachelor of Music, Music Education. Casey K. Oregon, Bachelor of Music, Music Education, Bachelor of Music, Music Performance. Ron Pfeiffer, Bachelor of Music, Music Education. <laughs> Rebecca Rapley, Bachelor of Music, Music Education. <laughs> Congratulations, music graduates. It is my pleasure to introduce Dr. Glenn Hubbard from the College of Communication, who will introduce the Bachelor of Science graduate degree. Hi, everybody. Congratulations to our graduates. And thank you to the families and parents uh, for sharing these folks with us, because it's our honor to work with them. Um, we begin. Amber Allen, BS in Communication, Interpersonal Organizational Communication. Claire Anderson, BS Communication, Interpersonal Organizational Com. Anissa Baptist. Andrew Cheek, BS Communication, Interpersonal Organizational Com. Jewel Cook, BS Communication, Interpersonal Organizational Com. Terrence Terrell Copper Jr., BS Communication, Interpersonal Organizational Com. Kiki Cummings, BS Communication, Interpersonal Organizational. Rick DeBru, BS Communication, Interpersonal Organizational. Trinity Madison Dunlap, BS Communication, Interpersonal Organizational. Francisco Elvira, BS Communication, Interpersonal Organizational. Grayson Emery, BS Communication, Interpersonal Organizational. Patricia Evans, BS Communication, Interpersonal Organizational. Alex Fisher, BS Communication, Interpersonal Organizational. Woo! 
Lindsay Fleischman, BS Communication, Interpersonal Organizational. Malik Fleming, BS Communication, Interpersonal Organizational. Meredith Lee France, BS Communication, Interpersonal Organizational. Danielle Godwin, BS Communication, Interpersonal Organizational. David Edward Howard, BS Communication, Interpersonal Organizational. Rachel Jacob, BS Communication, Interpersonal Organizational. Danielle Jedlicka, BS Communication, Interpersonal Organizational. Abigail Kathleen Keenan, BS Communication, Interpersonal Organizational. There you go. Emma Kokinda, BS Communication, Interpersonal Organizational. Mary Lou Cornegy, BS Communication, Interpersonal Organizational. Haley Kraft, BS Communication, Interpersonal Organizational. Megan Lauer, BS Communication, Interpersonal Organizational. Tyler Leach, BS Communication, Interpersonal Organizational. Melissa Lee, BS, Communication, Interpersonal Organizational. Renee Claire Marnier, BS, Communication, Interpersonal Organizational. Kendall Ann McDade, BS, Communication, Interpersonal Organizational. James Ming, BS Communication, Interpersonal Organizational. Latatius Danis Morris, BS Communication, Interpersonal Organizational. Griffin Mashlivik, BS Communication, Interpersonal Organizational. Carlos Batista, BS Communication, Interpersonal Organizational. Anna Caroline Penwell, BS Communication, Interpersonal Organizational. Catherine Polson, BS Communication, Interpersonal Organizational. Jawan Powell, BS Communication, Interpersonal Organizational. <laughs> Sheila Satur, BS Communication, Interpersonal Organizational. <laughs> Catherine Sheevy, BS Communication, Interpersonal Organizational. Caitlin Solecki, BS Communication, Interpersonal Organizational. <laughs> Michael Stallings, BS Communication, Interpersonal Organizational. <laughs> Noah Stop, BS Communication, Interpersonal Organizational. Ezekiel Zion Vili, BS Communication, Interpersonal Organizational. <laughs> Olivia Monet Walker, BS Communication, Interpersonal Organizational. 
Regine Walker, BS Communication, Interpersonal Organizational. Presley Savannah Walter, BS Communication, Interpersonal Organizational. Brooke Walton, BS Communication, Interpersonal Organizational. Jeremiah Williams, BS Communication, Interpersonal Organizational. Jody Woodall, BS Communication, Interpersonal Organizational. Maria Christina Ziegler, BS Communication, Interpersonal Organizational. Tristan Dane Zerofsky, BS Communication, Interpersonal Organizational. And if you're tired of hearing me say interpersonal organizational, as I am, uh, we now go to journalism. Brendan Cavazos, BS Communication, Journalism. Abby Clavijo, BS Communication, Journalism. Reina Arian Crooms, BS Communication, Journalism. Jayla Davis, BS Communication, Journalism. Micah Dennis, BS Communication, Journalism. Jamie Ennis, BS Communication, Journalism. Sarah Landon Harris, BS Communication, Journalism. Hannah Leah Hansley, BS Communication, Journalism. Catherine Gray Jenkins, BS Communication, Journalism. Mary Catherine Laughlin, BS Communication, Journalism. Michelle Mazze, BS Communication, Journalism. Matthew Dalton Ordonez, BS Communication, Journalism. Emily Peake, BS Communication, Journalism. Michaela Perkins, BS Communication, Journalism. Victoria Ann Romanzik, BS Communication, Journalism. <laughs> Amarachi Uche, BS Communication, Journalism. <laughs> Nyquan Wilson, BS Communication, Journalism. Sutton Young, BS Communication Journalism. And a huge assistant to me. Tiffany Lene Belfield, BS Communication Journalism. Media Studies. Jocelyn Grace Bourbeau, BS Communication Media Studies. Cecilia Michelle Bowden, BS Communication Media Studies. Freedom Briasia Brown, BS Communication Media Studies. Miaja Larice Coley, BS Communication Media Studies. Brianna Cowan, BS Communication Media Studies. Liam Crowley, BS Communication Media Studies. Sarah Green, BS Communication Media Studies.
Jaden Ray Haswell, BS Communication Media Studies. Emmanuel Manny Hickman, BS Communication Media Studies. Kyle Jenkins, BS Communication Media Studies. Camille Leathers, BS Communication Media Studies. Emily Redeker, BS Communication Media Studies. Veronica Rousey, BS Communication Media Studies. Ilza Arafieva, BS Communication Public Relations. Julia Broughton, BS Communication Public Relations. Georgia Jean Carver, BS Communication Public Relations. Haven Reese Clemens, BS Communication Public Relations. Wallace Rose Cortazar, BS Communication Public Relations. Ella Duran, BS Communication Public Relations. <laughs> Hannah Eccleston, BS Communication Public Relations. <laughs> Sydney Gilmore, BS Communication Public Relations. Julia Gleason, BS Communication Public Relations. Alexa Tiara Heath, BS Communication Public Relations. Kristen Heller, BS Communication Public Relations. Megan Hogan, BS Communication Public Relations. Yeah! Gerald David Huffman, BS Communication Public Relations. Yeah! Jessica Johnson, BS Communication Public Relations. Yeah! India Jones, BS Communication. Lauren Lester, BS Communication Public Relations, a double major with a BA in philosophy as well. Nick C. Lynn, BS Communication Public Relations. Morgan Lewandowski, BS Communication. Jenna Marie Magner, BS Communication Public Relations. Gabby Mandrano, BS Communication Public Relations. <laughs> Bailey Minemeyer, BS Communication Public Relations. <laughs> Jordan Pretty. BS Communication Public Relations. Julian Alexander Rankin, BS Communication Public Relations. Olivia Rose, BS Communication Public Relations. Dalmira Lizette Santos, BS Communication. Bianca Seagraves, BS Communication Public Relations. Yeah. 
Ryan Sergio, BS Communication, Public Relations. Presley Shaw, BS Communication, Public Relations. Murphy Shingler, BS Communication. Isabella Soltz, BS Communication, Public Relations. Stryker Stubbs, BS Communication, Public Relations. Sarah Sykes, BS Communication, Public Relations. Emma Grace Jordan Turner, BS Communication, Public Relations. Cheyenne Wagner, BS Communication, Public Relations. Quinn Willard, BS Communication, Public Relations. Madison Beck Wingert, BS Communication, Public Relations. Chris Young, BS Communication, something or other. Thank you. Augustine Zarati, BS Communication, Public Relations. Sydney Zentz, BS Communication, Public Relations. Congratulations to the 2023 graduating class. And now back to Dr. Linda Keen, our Dean. Congratulations again to the class of 2023. The band will now lead us in the singing of the alma mater, which is printed on the back of your program. Thank you very much. Woo! 